What's up, everybody? I am Stryker. It is the K-Rock Absolute Almost Acoustic Christmas. We're in the Form Club. The Interrupters are here! Yeah. All right, uh, guys, I want to introduce you to my newest radio partner. That's Klein right there. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. What's up, Klein? They Hi. call me the Interrupters of the Stryker Show, so it's good. <laughs> I right. interrupt Stryker on a daily basis. <laughs> I love it. Kevin, I want to go to you first. Yes. We know as fans of the band that this is a big accomplishment and it's cool for you guys to do this, but leading up to it, did you have nerves? A hundred percent. And it, they came in the form of like butterflies. It was like excitement. It wasn't like, oh no, I don't. It was just, we just wanted to, we appreciate the moment so much. So we just wanted to give it a hundred percent. And, and like, like I said on stage, we grew up listening to K-Rock. So it's, it's huge for us. It's just huge to be here. So yeah, nerves for sure. <laughs> How about for you, Amy? Um, this is a dream come true. We can't believe that we're here and we had the best time and we're just, we're just, this is like, um, you know, everything we've ever wanted when we were little kids growing up and Kevin said tonight, uh, on, on the stage, he said, if it wasn't for K-Rock, we wouldn't have picked up our guitars. So this is wow. really a really special night. Yeah. Wow. And Justin and Jesse, you guys used to, true or false, and then expand on this, would record K-Rock shows and make mixtapes? Yeah. Tell us. So we had two boom boxes that were, one had a microphone in it, and the other one we'd have K-Rock on, and we'd sit there, and when it would come back from commercials, we'd hit record, and if we liked the song, we'd let it keep playing <laughs> and recording. And if we didn't like the song, we'd stop it and rewind it and record over it. The best well. for block party weekends, because yeah. you get multiple songs from a band you like. Yes. All right, you're really aging us here, guys. Sorry. <laughs> that is, uh, technically, guys, that is illegal bootlegging, and you owe us money now. <laughs> oh, it was before Napster, don't All worry. All right, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> and is there one band or two or three that still lives with you? Not maybe an obvious one, but are, are there some bands that you recorded back then that you love? Uh, well, they all, I mean, Green Day and Blink-182 and Offspring and Rancid. even Smashing Pumpkins, Rancid, of course, and yeah, I could go on. Now that you guys have kind of accomplished, I would imagine, what was one of the original band goals, which was get on the stage at K-Rock's Almost Acoustic Christmas, do you have the next goal set yet? Or is it one of those weird moments now where you're like, wow, we've done, this is as far as we saw the road going? <laughs> well, how about we do the weenie roast? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. All right, people like it. I'm putting that out there. <laughs> I'm locking in. Can you just sign your name right there? <laughs> just, write, just write your name and this is good. There we go. Okay. Weenie roast. Uh, make it happen. That is a <laughs> legal document, clearly. <laughs> yep. Get it notarized. Uh, Doug, we are so happy to see everything that's happened for the band because we all know at your fans, us that work at K-Rock, how hard you work and it's not easy to get where you're at and you've done it. And we're going to end this interview because we've talked so much over the last couple years. Let's play a this or that. We're going to say this or that and the band comes together very fast and gives us your answer. Okay. This is holiday related. Oh, Here awesome. we go. Better villain, Grinch or the Wet Bandits? The Wet, wet Bandits. bandits. <laughs> yeah, unanimous. I like that. This has torn bands apart before, so I hope you take this seriously. <laughs> Guys, uh, what is a worse Christmas food? A fruitcake or virgin eggnog? Oh, oh they're b I would oh. probably reject both, both of those yeah. if they were offered to me. Virgin eggnog. Virgin yeah. eggnog. Yeah. It's yeah. Cr criminal. Okay. Criminal. <laughs> All right, talking to the interrupters, what is more fun? A snowball fight or peeing in the snow? More, f more fun? Yes. I think peeing in the snow and then having a snowball fight. <laughs> 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 that sounds like a nightmare. Uh, <laughs> it turns out you're the villain of Christmas. <laughs> yes, sorry. <laughs> the dark twin. Um, let me ask you this. If you guys could get under the mistletoe with any band here tonight, which band Jared would you Leto. pick? Jared Leto. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. We just saw him right out there, and he is breathtaking. He was truly. breathtaking. He is. Yeah. Okay. And what a performer, too. Very, very good. Yeah. All right, here we go. What about you guys? Uh, Davey there. Havoc. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. I'd say Davey Havoc. Klein, what about you? Who would you uh, put under the I would mistletoe? do a uh, little Davey Havoc, little Jared Leto, kind of a... Waving <laughs> 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 All right. Better movie Santa. Billy Bob Thornton is bad Santa or Tim Allen is the Santa Claus. Oh, Billy Bob. Billy Bob, Billy come Bob. on. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you guys are in such great units that I love you. Yeah. Guys so much. <laughs> yes. And finally, and this is a very important question and it's based on what you guys decided to wear tonight, but what is a worst Christmas gift? Socks or something homemade? 
Oh, something homemade. homemade. I, what? You can, you can never have enough sauce. I do something homemade every year, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> do you? Wow. Maybe wow. That's a hint, the true, Jamie. true colors are shining through. <laughs> oh, man. They are the interrupters. Fight the good fight <laughs> is the latest album. They've done three of them. They're from Southern California. Tim Armstrong was on stage with them tonight. They are the best, the interrupters. And we are backstage night one of the K-Rock Absolute Almost Acoustic Christmas. You guys are the best. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Thank you. Thank you.